Acumatica has some really powerful tools that really help with day-to-day -day efficiencies. Data entry can be daunting sometimes in accounting, especially if you have transactions that are very long entries or transactions that need to import from other systems. So I'm going to show you how you can accomplish this manually with a general ledger entry. The first thing that you want to do is determine what the Excel import file format should look like so that when you get ready to do your import, it flows in without any issues or any errors. And this is really simple. Let's begin by going into the finance area and I'm going to go into general ledger, journal transactions. You can see that I'm setting on one transaction right now and what I'm going to do is export this so that I can see what the file requirements are like in order to do an import because they're identical. So I just click on the Excel button and then it's going to dump a file out for me that I can then open and use as a beginning for a template. So right down here I'm going to select file open and let me bring this over here to this screen for you and you can see that for this journal entry fields that are available for import are here across the top right and that the standard formatting is that you have your debit and credit accounts with a dollar amount and then whatever you want the transaction description to be so what I've done in preparation for this little tip today is I've already created a journal entry that has many lines on it so I'm going to close this and here's what I set up for our discussion today. So I've got a journal entry that has, let's see how many lines did I create in this? 70 lines with associated debits and credits using that same template style that we had before. So this journal here called General Ledger Journal Entry is what we're going to import. Let me just save this out and close it. Now we're ready to do our import. This is very simple. What I'm going to do is create a new journal entry and then I'm going to tell it that I'm going to load records from a file. Choose my file. General Ledger Journal Entry. We'll open it and we're going to tell it to upload. We'll take the default. And of course, because I started with an export and I was assured of what my mapping should be, I don't have to worry about mapping any of this, so I can just check all the defaults here as well. Click on OK. You can see up here that it's importing the transaction. This one has 71 lines. You can see it came in very quickly. It came in as a total debit of 60510 credit of 60510 and there are all of those transactions. And now it's sitting here ready for you to post it. The nice thing about this with Acumatica is that this same process of being able to export a transaction so that you can see what the template requirements are for import and the upload is the same throughout the system. So this same process that I just showed you for General Ledger will also work for Accounts Receivable, Accounts Payable, and all the other transaction detail modules. It's as simple as that.